organizational affiliation. So, hi, I'm Corinna Gore, and I'm with the Center for Earth Ethics at Union Theological Seminary. I uh, was very um, proud to be a part of this action and this movement here against the West Roxbury Lateral Pipeline, which is part of a whole system of pipelines, a, a fossil fuel build out at a time when we're already experiencing climate impacts, when we know that putting more of this pollution into the air is going to cause serious harm and death and suffering for people on the other side of the world and for our own future generations. What happened today was really important. We had a long and winding road, but essentially the people that put themselves in the way of building this fossil fuel pipeline were found not responsible by reason of necessity. And the irony of that is that we are making ourselves responsible. We are part of the movement that's standing up and saying we won't let this go by on our watch. We won't act like nothing's wrong. Uh, we're going to, to be speaking up in new ways. We're going to be uh, demanding that the people who are in elected office and also the corporations uh, who are putting their costs, the cost of their doing business for their own profits, they are putting that cost on the public. They're putting that cost on future generations. And we are taking responsibility to say no to that. Um, so it's, it's really a wonderful day to be with uh, friends in this movement, to understand the importance of what happened, and also to focus on where we go next. We, we are currently facing a situation with an administration who has made us the United States the only country in the world that officially doesn't recognize climate change as a problem. Uh, we, it's not good enough. It's not good enough for our future generations of life and it's not good enough for our own moral integrity. So uh, I just want to, to say thank you um, to the people of West Roxbury, to the people um, who built this movement, uh, to the lawyers who've been working with us. Uh, it's, been, it's been great to be a part of it.